What's up, Pokey Peeps? How are y'all doing today? I'm doing great. How about you? Pretty good. We got a fun, exciting video for y'all again. It's always so fun and exciting. <laughs> we got some more Evolution tins. He got a Flareon. I got a Jolteon. <clears throat> I don't think I've me. done Flareon yet. So. No, I did the Flareon in the last video. Done Vaporeon and Jolteon. We also have some more of these pin packs, which... This time, we each get to open up one, and on the third pack, we are going to flip the Charizard coin to see who gets to open up what pack. And, whenever we hit 100 subscribers, we are going to do a pin giveaway. So Maybe something else. Oh, yeah. So, tell your friends about us, send our link to them, get as many friends and family members in as you can to get you a chance to win. Whenever that video comes, whenever we hit our 100th subscriber, it's going to be a special video. It might not be posted on our regular yeah, Tuesday true. or Friday schedule. It may be posted on another day, but we won't know until we hit our 100th subscriber. <laughs> and we also have the... Go ahead and move these guys out of the way. It came in the mail today. It is the Jumbo Pokemon Card Collector Show the other side. binder. Me. It has the Yellow Cheeks Pikachu. And there's also something else in here. I have not opened it up. I've had to fight myself from opening it up. It really has. Here's the box appearance. I'm going to set the box up here. So I'm the one that opened up the package. Yeah, he thought it was something for him because I put his name on it. I was kind of disappointed. <laughs> but I'm kind of not. This binder is a bit heavy. It does have weight to it. So we're going to start opening this with this. And then we are going to insert all four of our cards. Would you like to show off the last three that we got? I will. While I open this bad boy up. We got a cool little Groki, which I think is pretty cool. A, a high jumping score bunny, which is still very cool. And then we got Crybaby Sobble. That cries a lot. What's fun and exciting about these jumbo cards is. The 25th anniversary Pikachu is a hollow or a metallic color, whichever one you like to say. So that's pretty cool. Here's the Pikachu card up close. Oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. Here is a little booklet that I was so excited about seeing. Oh, wow. Okay. So this is going to interest y'all very much if you are collecting these jumbo cards. Let's just say I'm more excited for uh, September. It shows you, I'm going to make us out of the frame, I'm sorry, but I'm going to try to do this a little bit. We all know which one's the best. It right shows there. you which month of which starter jumbo cards are going to come out. So this is the first month. Next month in April will be the Alola region. May will be the Kalos region. Did I say it wrong? Kalos. Kalos, my bad. Kalos. And then June will be Unava. 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 July oh, will be the Sinnoh. Oh, she actually got one right. August will be uh, the Hoenn. September will be the Johto. And October will be Kanto. So here's a up closer look of that for y'all to see. And it even has a little weird box up here. I'd read it to you, but I'm pretty sure y'all probably read that to yourself. If I can get it all on there. You might have to pause your screen to read that. And here's the checklist it comes with. You can check them off as you collect them. How cool is that? We definitely have to check off the ones that we have. Oh, wow. That is, yeah, that is fun and exciting. So... For y'all to maybe you need to screenshot this so you can have it in case you don't get the binder or you can't get your hand on the binder. This is, if I can get it open, the card sleeves for the binder. Big and one. it's nice and sturdy. 
It has nice, good plastic, good cardboard in it. She's over there hitting it. <laughs> Gotta make sure it's good and worth the money. And uh, I'd say it is. How about you? Yeah. So we're gonna go Pretty ahead cool. and get these big guys in here. We might as well go ahead and put Yellow Cheeks Pikachu in the first. And what's uh, what I thought was cool about it is that on Pikachu it actually says the level. These don't, but that's okay. No, they are S W H O O or zero zero one. Sword and Shield. Yep. Sword and Shield one. Sword and Shield two. Mhm. Mm we we'll go with Grogi because he plays music like me. We are going to try to collect all these jumbo cards. We're going to try our best to. So, each month, whenever the new set comes out, we are going to try our best to get our hands on them. So we can add them in on the binder. I hope I get Totodile. Is Totodile one of them? Yes, he is. Where's the start? Starter for Johto. Here's what the jumbo cards look like in their giant card sleeve in the binder. There we go. And now we have many more to collect. And I'm excited about that. <laughs> I want to get this entire binder full now. That is true. This is a great way to uh, keep your collection together. For your normal size Pokemon cards, they do sell uh, card sleeves. And you can get a binder at like a Dollar Tree or a Dollar General for like a dollar. Put them in there and bam, label it, you're good to go. Yep. Okay, let's get some card packs opened up. I'm, I'm done babbling on about the binder. I'm just excited about it. Okay, let's do some, should we do the 10s or card packs? I'm going to do the card packs first. Alrighty, I'm going to open up this one. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I won't have a hard time opening up this time. Now this one comes with two booster packs and a pin. Do be careful if you are wearing the pin. Make sure you insert it carefully. Do not get jabbed. Do not jab yourself. It is very painful. It's not feel good. If you do accidentally jab yourself, make sure you clean the wing properly and bandage it up. I have a terrible time opening these bags. But there's my pen though. It's just like the one from the last video. See, but I think mine's cool. Ha! I got an opening now. Now we do want to thank everyone who has subscribed to our channel so far. We are very excited about it. Now, comment down below if I'm right. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's Necrozma and Sogaleo mixed. And that's Lunala and Necrozma. Or Mine's glaring what's too his much. face. I'm pretty sure that's it. We'll have to look that up. We were supposed to look it up in the last video. Just, but we kind of got a little busy. Just double check it's not focusing for me. I'm pretty there we go. I'm pretty sure that is right. You may see. You may hand me yours. No, I see it. Okay. Now I finally got mine to focus. I got my packs out. Yeah, 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 yeah. In these two packs that we got, we have Sun and Moon and Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion. Ooh. Since he started the last video with the card opening, I will start. No. I started the last video. No, I did. Oh, no, I did. No, I did. No, I started the one before that. I just don't want to open first. I guess I'm going to be breaking our uh, normal thing that we do. And I guess I'm going to be opening first I'll today. do it first. <laughs> I don't like opening up first. I don't know what it is about it. I just, not a fan. We do have our card sleeves ready in case there is any full arts pool today. Mine's cool. Mine's pretty cool because how often do you get to catch a legendary in a regular Pokeball? I've caught four or five of them. 
backwards. I actually know I'm, I've caught more. I've caught more. Well, already, let's get these card openings going because I'm pretty sure they're waiting on us for that. Yep. Oh, before we start, let's have a little contest down below in the comments. Who do you think will pull the first pool art of the day? The Sports in the tents do not count as the promo cards. They do not count at all. So we actually have to pull them from a deck of cards. That is true. <clears throat> we like to have a little fun competition with that. Usually he's the one that always pulls the full arts. But I hope luck is on my side. Okay, you can go now. Fire. Because I'm feeling furious today. Lightning. <laughs> no. I'm pretty good at guessing the energy. That wish washy. Alolan Radicate. Experience Share. Cosmog. Fomantis. Alolan Grimer. You want to say this one? No, I'm good. Togedemaru. I have a feeling I'm going to pull that card. Stuffle. I got a Reverse Hollow Dragonair. Very cool. And then for my rare, I got Incineroar. Was that on your card pack? It was on my card pack. Show the card pack. It was on my card pack because I got Incineroar right there. It's always fun pulling the card that is on the card pack cover. Well, I find it cool. fun. Here is my Poke Player card number. Now make sure y'all share these codes because Sharon is caring. Guess that energy. Psychic. I'm going to say electric. Now the card trick on these. Oh, it's very. Do I have it upside down? I have it upside down. The card trick on these are four. For anyone wondering, this was the sun and moon. Briny? <laughs> Brioni? She's killing me with these names. Brioni? Well, sure. What is it? We'll go with Brioni. What is it, Brioni? We'll go with that. No, tell me what it is so I know. <sighs> Fine, be that way. I got a lowland Persian. She should be getting these names. Maku, ma, Makudita? Makudita? Makuhita. Oh, Makuhita. Don't get that one wrong. Chin Chow! I told you I was gonna pull it. Togedemaru? She only got that right because I pulled it. <laughs> Carvana? No, no, no. Is that not? Oh, I see what you did there. Pick it up. Pick a pick. <gasps> oh, pick a pick. Sorry, I got excited over this, but I got a reverse hollow dragonite. <laughs> I love my dragonairs. And my dragonites. And my jatinis. Okay. And actually what's kind of funny is I got Incineroar too. Except that wasn't on my card pack. Who did I have on my card pack? It wasn't him. I didn't put that over there. So we have two Incinerars. Code card. I'm going with water this time. I'm going to say dark. Yes! That's going to be oh, my wait. second choice. Yeah, uh-huh. Larian. Kakuna. Excel Gore. Execute Magic Card Minchino Core Fish Winky Faced Shelves. Excuse me. Oh, I got a reverse hollow Hakamalo. Oh, I always butcher that name. And then for my rare, I got a camera up. Alrighty, here is my player code card. I have it upside down. What is up with me being upside down today? I don't know. 
That's that energy. Dark. I'm going to say electric. Grass again. Someone's feeling very grassy. Maybe because we're doing our garden soon. Probably. Chichino. Chichino. A lowland graveler. Devoured field. Hold on now. Sound that one out. Pound door. Is that not it? No, it's it. Oh. A Pikachu. Skidoo. Starly. Mammal. Salazzle. Salazzle. It's a reverse hollow. What is it? Salazzle. So I did say it right the second time. Salazzle. And I also got Houndoom, which is the evolved form of Houndor, if you did not know. Nice. Alrighty, now comes the fun part. We are going to flip to see who gets what pack. I'll flip. Heads. I'll flip, you open. Heads will be the regular Sun and Moon. Tails will be the Crimson Invasion Sun and Moon. I'm going to go with Crimson Invasion. So you want tails. I want tails. It's heads. I got heads. We got a Charizard. So that means you get the regular Sun and Moon. Which I'm okay with. Yeah, I did pretty good on opening this one this time. the pen that comes in it. We're having technical difficulties already? Yes. Here's your pack, sir. Mm -hmm. And here's okay. mine. Okay. Let's do this. Ooh, that's a bad angle. Huh? I had a bad angle there. I went like that. <laughs> okay. Let's get this. I'm going with water. One, two, three, four, fire. fire. Got to repel. The gold bad. Professor Kakui. Fomantis. Surskit. I, I swear, it looked like it had two legs, but it's a growler. Prayer Brawler. <laughs> Marini. A Reverse Hollow. Arachnid. And for my rare, I got a Bruxious. I got two of those in the last video. Here is my player code card. Don't be a hog and hog them all up. Make sure you share them. I'm going with water. I'm going to say fire. Fairy! Okay. And I have it upside down again. She does that a lot. Lucimen? Lucimene. Lucimene. <laughs> oh. Lyron? Larian? Larian, Lyron, whatever. Larian? Sometimes she just give up. <laughs> Bunkaboo. Execute. Now, now, don't get that one wrong. It's Weedle. Followed along with a Shellos. Bunnably? Bunnably. <laughs> Bunnably. I got a reverse hollow Kamo O. Kamo O? Right? Yep. And for my rare Hydrogen? Hydrogen? Wait, hand me those Hydrogen. over there. What? She'll reach for them. Sometimes she, she talks to me like I don't know what it is. <laughs> okay, I'm going to show you all small sneak peek of the last video. I ended up pulling a reverse hollow and hollow version of this. Unfortunately. 
And I just got the regular version. <laughs> but I don't think they are from the same. No, they are not from the same deck of cards or card series, but they are the same Pokemon. So I find that funny. <laughs> Which we had some exciting pulls in our last video. Did you check them out? Someone pulled a very, very intriguing card. Oh, yeah. Oh, excuse me. I got the hiccups tonight. Now it's time to watch me struggle opening this. Mine's going to be oh. uh, pretty fast opening, hopefully. If I have to, I'll, oh, I'll get the pin. I cut it on the first try. This is the Jolteon Den. We have opened this one up before, and we have done a Flareon before. But, there are some packs in here that are fun and exciting. That is true. There's my Flareon GX promo. Still very cool. Here is the Jolteon. GX promo. You can still sleep these even if you have many of them because guess what? They are still worth something. <clears throat> Cold card. There is mine. Now let's see what packs we got. Ooh, I like the cover of mine already. Me too. Zorora. Yeah. Zero I got a cool. Sun and Moon Lost Thunder with Celebi. Crimson Invasion. I was shot it with you. So we both didn't have to Crim say it. Crimson Invasion. Burning Shadows. Oh. The one pack I didn't want. How about this? Steam I'll trade Siege. you one of mine. How about that? No, I'll take it. Okay. It's the same exact art cover that I got Just last you built time. It. I don't know if we yell both for this. So, which one shall we start on? Should we do the one that you don't like the most? Uh, yeah. We are started with Steam Sage, and I believe the card trick is over. Don't three? let me lie to you. Three? I'd have to check. I think it was three. So, I won't be able to guess the energy on this one because I'm going to check. Here's my player code card. I was doing it. I'll still go ahead and show mine though. No. And the fourth one is the rare. So it's three. So you can go ahead and guess the type if you'd like to. Fire. It's electric. It's Falafi. 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 Falafi floppy. I got, ooh, that one's. That is definitely not for me, but it has a small indention in it. Monofer. Or Monferno. Monferno. Antherath. Antherath. Oh, Antherath. <laughs> Mandine. She gets them wrong so many times. She loves. Maria. <clears throat> Drifloon. A sea dot. A reverse hollow mankey and a toxic road for my rare. Croak. Toxic croak. My bad. I don't know if I did it. I can't remember if I did the, the trick or not. You did. Oh. I must say electric. Well, no. Oh. Trainer. Still take it though. Ooh. That's a cool card. It looks like a shiny Azumarill. Y'all tell me, first. that's a shiny Azumarill. May I see that card? That is... Hold on. She's all the time trying to take stuff out of my hands. All the time. It starts to get hurtful sometimes. Well, I'm going to have to look into this because this is crazy. We never got a card like this before. That's true. A lampet. A shellos. Clauncher. Meow. A pip. 
nose pass. You got a reverse hollow dyno. And for my rare, I got a non holographic talon flame. So, still cool. In the description box, I normally include any full art's net value at the time of recording of this video. I usually add that in the description box below. But I'm going to make an exception today and I'm going to include this one because this is a fascinating card. I've never seen one like this. I honestly might sleeve it because I don't know if this is common or if it's rare. Um, I don't even know where I put my card sleeves. Oh, there they are. I'm faster at it. We're going to go ahead and sleeve it just in case if it's something that's not very common that's rare to come across. My mind, my, my, blah, 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 blah. my mind is blown. Okay, I'm going to do Crimson Invasion. I'm going to do Burning Shadows. The card trick with the Sun and Moon series is four, in case you did not know. Am I going first? Yeah, I was. Okay. Because I started off the video first. Here is my pokey. I did. Okay. Yeah. I thought I did. Oh, you went on ahead and did that last pack, even though I was supposed to go. I don't remember. Well, you can let me go then. Because I know you didn't like that pack. Cold card. I'm going with water. I'm going to say fairies. We've gotten so many fairies. Yes. Victory. Victory. I'm proud of myself. Water. Yes. Got Proton Dex, Pokey Finder Mode. Super Scoop Up. Electabuzz. More Lol. Her brawler. Stuffle. Inkay. Duskull. A reverse hollow. Krogunk. Just cool. And then for my rare, I got a uh, Tangrowth. Alrighty, you. Which is cool because this is the first time we've ever pulled that one too. I swear that reminds me of. A monster from Yu-Gi-Oh, but I can't think of it. Is it called Tangela? <laughs> Similar. Alrighty, guess that energy. Fire. Electric. Fairy! Hey, at least it wasn't upside down this time. You know, I meant to say fairy. I got a counter energy. A fighting memory. A counter catcher. Kane? Cacnea. Cacnea. I'm is, sorry. Is it's a, not, the it's way a, it's I, a cactus. The way my mind thinks of it, it's not like that. You're going to have a field day on that one. Mistrevious? Shelmet? <gasps> Swablu? Shwino? A reverse hollow gladian? Gladian? Mm -hmm. And I got another Octillery for my rare. I pulled a lot of Octillery's in the last video. The names are killing me. He's <sighs> killing me. I'm trying. That's all that matters. Sure. Cold call. Fire. Dark. I think you're trying to look just so you can get some. I'm not even looking. I think. Kind of wish I was. What? Pile of swine. Psychic memory. Dashing pouch. Gas. 
this way. Why are you doing it like that? Quillfish. Mancino. Weedle. I don't like Weedle. It evolves into a bee. Cubone. I got a reverse hollow starly. Very cool. And then for my rare, I got a Starmy. Non holographic. You don't like it because it's a bee. It's a bee. Oh, excuse me. Alrighty, guess the energy, mister. I don't like bees. I know you don't. I don't like anything that'll sting me. You gonna guess? Electric. I'm going to say fire. Electric. Oh. Three in a row. There's my player code card. Three in a row. I got a escape rope. Bufflant. Bufflant. Bufflant, my bad. Electric. Mm. Oh, that's got a bad factory mark on it. And I got a Caterpie. Ooh, this one does too. You see him? It's electric. Oh. Electric. Electric. I electric don't know. Electric sounds cooler. Panpour. Ooh, this one's got a scratch across it. Alolan Radata. Mudbury. Magic card. A reverse hollow tangela. Oh, front pile. And a bruxish. Bruxish. Those ones had some bad factory marks across them. By that, I mean where it shows where an indention is on the card. We are now moving on to Sun and Moon Lost Thunder. I'm hoping for last pack magic right now. I really am. I'm going with fairy. Dark. Just because I seen fairy right there. Fighting. fighting. Ain't no one guessed fighting yet. No, we have not. Choice helmet. Mantine. Oh. That's like giraffe. Gir giraffe. See, look, he makes fun of me, and guess what? He can't even say one. <laughs> I'm probably closer. Panko. Combi. Another B. Yeah. <laughs> Lit Leo. Without bees, we will not have plants. I'll be okay with it. Cutie fly. You'd be okay with no oxygen? Yes. Hop it. A reverse hollow. And for us. We have not gotten that one before. And then for the rare. Which, uh, that, that is a female. A female pyro. We have not gotten that one before at all. Since you finished off your pack with fire, I'm going to guess fire for mine. I said fairy. That's how much fairy, fire, water. Fire! Technically, I guess that. Yeah. Shenotic? Cochleon? That was close. <laughs> Arithor Foundational Play? Aether. Oh, Aether. Onyx? Morlow? Morlow. Madri? Rumple? Jigglypuff? A Reverse Hollow? Chansey? And for my rare? Bear tick with a nice mustache or beard. He's very chilly. It is, uh, it is a nice circle, isn't it? Yep. This was fine too. It also has ice on its bottom. Is that ice? I thought that was fuzz. It's also got it on its belly. He's just cold hearted. 
Cub Chew. It's just a bit chilly for him. Hmm? It's a bit chilly. Cold, chilly. No. <sighs> well, this was actually fun and exciting. Because this card has me baffled right now. So after this video, I'm going to have to do some research on it. I'm the one that does the research on all the cards. I'm just here to open. My favorite site, in case any of y'all are wondering what I use to get a net worth value of the cards, is called Maven. What I normally do is I'll type the name of the Pokey card in the Google search bar. Then I'll include the card number, which can always be found in the bottom. And uh, it'll pull up many different sites. A lot of them are for like selling and holding them. But if you look at Maven, it shows you the highest price it's sold for, the lowest price it's sold for, recent ones it's sold for, and it even gives you a net worth value at that time of what it oh, could yeah. be. So I find that I, I find it more informational than a lot of the sites like eBay, Etsy, um, those kinds of sites. So I definitely go with Maven. Yeah, I don't know. That's why I said I'm the one that does all the searching on the cards. Yeah, I don't touch. But today was fun and exciting. Even though there was no full arts pool, that is perfectly okay. We don't, the full arts are just a plus. It's all part of it. You get them. Sometimes you don't. But we are most definitely excited about all of these. <laughs> well, he's excited about Toto. Toto down big three. Or I should say little three. And he's excited about Chikorita because that's one of his favorite. And what's the other one? Trachea? No. Well, I know it's Totodile, Chikorita. There's the one in between it. Cynical? He's got a lot of favorite Pokemon. It's mainly Totodile. I like Toad Owl. It's my favorite one. He basically likes the Johto region. I think the Johto region is the best. I mean, true, you can't really beat the original. I disagree. <laughs> what I find it funny is if I get this correct, correct me if I'm wrong, the way that they are releasing them is from the most recent starters all the way to the very first one. Correct? Yep. Yeah. I, the only ones that I really know of, I know it's going to sound no, bad. No, no, not really. Is it not in the order that they all came out of, except backwards? I don't think so. I'll have to look into that. Probably. But, we'll find out. All right, dudes and chicks. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on that bell notification to be notified when we upload our next video. Yes. And we'll see who pulls the next first full art. He says him, I say me. Maybe luck will be on my side for once. Not while I'm around. Yeah, probably. Well, alrighty guys, y'all have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye!